Okay, hi guys. Uh, I'm waiting for somebody, so I decided to quickly make this video so I can share this simple and easy strategy to trade US 30. I posted a video, the previous video, uh, with the link to a system uh, that can make you money uh, trading these indices. However, some of you say that the system is not useful at this point because you do not yet have laptops. You are not trading on laptops, but you are trading on your phones, which is not a major problem. Of course, personally, uh, it's my personal uh, preference. I would prefer trading on a laptop than trading on a phone because on a laptop you get the bigger picture you can see the bigger picture than on a phone the phone screen can only show you so much and on the phone you usually need to snap out a lot in order to get the bigger picture which is the problem uh, for many people because without doing this it's very easy to see situations that are not there so people usually make this mistake they judge entries when they are zoomed in like this on the phone you need to zoom out to see the bigger picture that's the mistake people make so sometimes, for example, if you are trading with RSI or stochastics, because you are zoomed in, you might see that everything is oversold or overbought. Only when you zoom out, then you realize that, no, you are not even there. You are not even in those zones. So that's how people lose money trading with their phone. So if you can buy a laptop, and trade using your laptop and use the phone only to monitor your trades but that does not mean that you cannot trade using your phone you can still trade using your phone if you follow the tip that i just gave you you need to always zoom out to get a clearer picture of what's going on don't just base your decisions like this when you've not even seen what's going on okay sorry about that but i had to explain to some people concerning that okay so today we are going to talk about this strategy it's very simple it's going to help you to get some pips out of the market some money into your pocket and it's very simple basically what you are using in this strategy are three things just three things how is that for simple so we are using it to trade us 30. you can try to use it with the other indices but uh, we are using it to trade US 30 what you need is your stochastic that's what you are looking at at the bottom there it's your default stochastic I'll give you settings at the end of the video okay let's discuss uh, how to trade with this system then now uh, we'll get to the system uh, to the settings so you have your stochastic your moving averages and what's the third indicator the most important one that people usually forget it's price action yes i said it you are using three indicators your stochastic your moving averages and importantly price action people tend to only focus on indicators and forget what price is doing you need to look at what price is doing so this is the system that i've been using to get pips sometimes uh, hundreds sometimes less than a hundred sometimes 
I even lose with the system. That's part of trading. If somebody comes to you and tells you that they've got a system that is 100%, 100% profitable, I'm telling you, friend, run. You're, you are about to get scammed. There is no 100% profitable system anywhere. Otherwise, everyone will be billionaires by now. And why would they sell a system that makes them billions? So, you might take losses here and there with this system, but overall, you are going to make profit. If you are faithful and disciplined to the rules, you need to master the rules. You need to be disciplined. That's how you are going to make money. So how do we trade with this system? Uh, say we are looking for a sale. This is a good example here. You already see what's happening. You have your moving averages crossing and your stochastic has crossed as well a long time ago it crossed and the third and most important indicator price has crossed the moving averages that's all you need to know and it closed there price crossed the moving averages and it closed there so what do you do you sell that's all you need you sell and you ride that selling wave ideally i would want to set uh, my support and resistance so that i can take my profit at those points i do not usually want to wait for price to return there so what I do is, after I enter here, I look at what price is doing as it approaches the next support or resistance zone. If price is showing me that it's losing momentum like this, price does, just doesn't turn. It's going to drop hints like this when the candles start getting shorter. It's hints that momentum is getting out of the market. This is where I would what? Take my profit. That's it. And you see the stochastic is now saying it's turning up. It might go up all the way or it might still go down. But here it's already showing that we are going to be ready for a buy so that's a sale setup let's look for a buy setup this is how you buy by the way by the way i forgot to mention this i'm using a one hour chart i'm using a one hour chart you can still try this this strategy with your 30 minute chart or you can try it on your 15 minute chart see what works for you see what works for you maybe the one hour is not good for you so try on the other time frames uh, you never know so same approach we are waiting for price to cross over the moving averages and the moving averages have crossed and our stochastic has crossed yes the mistake people would make usually people just jump in at the cross of this stochastic without looking at the main charts and what price is doing usually it does this let me find an example okay for example here you would have sold there 
and you think you are going to ride it all this way down here but what does price do it goes back up and your stop loss gets hit what you need to do is you need to watch price you need to watch the moving averages and you need to watch the stochastic you are watching for three things don't watch for one thing don't watch for two things if you are going to fail because you are going to fail uh, no strategy is 100 percent but at least fail with three reasons three reasons you had three reasons for making that trade so if you're failing you are failing with three reasons okay so the first reason is our price rose above our moving averages and it closed there it never went down below the moving averages and the moving averages tend from red being above green to red being below green indicating bullish momentum that's our second indicator third indicator our stochastic our stochastic showing that we are bullish then you enter and like i said i usually prefer to ride it to the next resistance or support zone so i would have taken my profit there then wait and see what happens sometimes you are not going to win sometimes you are going to lose which is why you need to have proper money management don't try to be greedy the markets they love greedy traders because greedy traders lose money in the markets that's why the markets love greedy traders so don't be a greedy trader wait for your confirmations wait for price to cross the moving averages and it must close there and stay there it mustn't go down it must stay there this is a, a buy setup it must stay there and your moving averages have crossed and they are fanning out and your stochastic it's showing that we are buying that's how you trade this thing how or when not to trade this is a period of no trades when the moving averages are flat or close together when they are flat don't enter the markets you can even see the stochastic there it's consolidation don't do anything wait for the indicators to start angling show an angle either to the upside or to the downside and your price to start moving you can see that the candles they are indicating that something is happening and your stochastic must start showing that something is happening so you want to avoid looking for examples situations like this don't get into situations like this okay so what are the settings on this system the stochastic is default 1433 you don't need to do anything it's default your first moving average the red one is simple it's period 10 shift it's zero method is simple and you apply to close choose whatever color you love the second moving average is period 10 shift is zero the method is exponential so it's kind of the it's kind of the same moving average but here 
it's now exponential instead of simple choose again a, a color that you want for the indicator that's basically it that's basically it that's it hopefully this system helps you to make money and yeah leave a like uh, it's because you like my videos and share my videos that I continue to find these videos and systems and strategies for you so like the video leave a comment share the video with your friends if you have questions if you would want me to look for uh, certain strategies leave them in the comments box below and i'll try my best so until next time i hope this makes you money good luck and bye